Hello. Good evening, everyone. Hello, good evening. How are you? I'm very well. How about you? I am doing great. Very happy to be here. And okay. I was answering some questions from the other group. Sorry. They All were right. like, they were asking things, but we are here. I am very happy to see you once again and for sure to have the opportunity to share with you. I am going to wait for the rest of you to connect. The, all of them are appearing. Okay, Jancy, did you fix your camera? Yeah, it looks better now. It looks a lot better. You don't see. Oh, no, it's working again. Ash. Ya se nos, no, ni le hubiera preguntado, mire, ya se nos arruinó otra vez. <laughs> it was so perfect. It was so perfect. Yeah. Yeah. But, uh, Jancy, trate de desinstalar Zoom y lo vuelva a instalar para que le instale la actualización, porque ese es el problema. That's the problem. Good evening. Hello. Good evening. Good evening, everybody. It is a great happiness to have you here. How was your day? It was pretty good. It was pretty good. Okay, I am very happy. It was okay. pretty good, you say. So, eh, whose day was tiring? ¿Quién tuvo un día cansado? Whose day was tiring? Me too, teacher. Ah, me. Very <laughs> it was very tiring. Me either. Ah, Sandrita too. Everybody, I think it's tiring. In some cases, days are tiring, but nice. And in some cases, days are very tiring and not nice. <laughs> it was like, <laughs> you have echo there with your little baby. It, it happens the same with me. When, when I am sharing something, then my son replies the same thing. And, oh my God, someone is sick in the chat they sent a message. Well, most of us are here and for sure, I am very, very happy to start another class with the group. So my dear students, today I ask you to do it in a different way. I ask you for, a, for you to prepare a little bit of a, the minute speaking because we are going to do it in class. We are going to do it in groups and we are going to share for sure for one minute, but each person is going to uh, have a specific time to do it. And the question was, who can remind me about the question? ¿Cuál era we, la pregunta? Uh -huh. We have to talk about to use and used to. Uh -huh, the things that we you used to, to do. To, uh, when we were uh, like uh, young, right? When you were okay. younger, right? Porque well, jóvenes seguimos. When we were a little younger on vacations. Okay, right. what, what did you used to do when you were younger and when you had vacations? Because okay. it is different now, right? Now, when we have vacations, we clean the house, we organize everything. But what did you used to do when you had vacation and when you were younger? That was the topic that you were going to use for your one minute speaking, okay? Today, we're going to start the class with a little activity. I am going to be showing you different pictures and you are going to give me sentences about them. For sure, using simple past, right? You can use simple past and you can say, you can use used to if you want. And the idea is that you create original sentences with it, okay? You can, um, you can invent your sentences in past and you can also use used to on uh, the creation of sentences. What about this one? What sentence could you give me with this one? It's right. Aha, but give me a complete sentence in past. Um, yesterday past. was raining. Yesterday, yesterday but now I'm taking classes. Rain. Okay, okay. <laughs> yesterday it was raining, but now it is not raining and I am night. taking classes at night. Okay, good. Yes. So there you go, right? Yesterday it was raining or mm -hmm. you can say it was raining yesterday, right? There you go. 
What about this one? Good evening, teacher. Excuse Hi, me. Good evening. I have a problem. Don't worry. The thing, the important thing is that you are here. Lo importante es que ya vi. Thank you, teacher. <laughs> okay. What sentence could you give me with this one? How I was. Past tense. Okay. I, I was. Uh -huh. I was working mm -hmm. in the garden yesterday. I was working in the garden yesterday. What about my father? If you say my father. My father was. My father. Where? My father was working in the garden. Yesterday. Yesterday, right? My father was working in the garden yesterday. Or you can say my father was picking up flowers. Right, picking up flowers. Estaba recolectando o recogiendo flores. He was picking up flowers. I am going to send it on the chat for you to have it. Picking up flowers. Okay, my recommendation, if I send you new words on the chat, copy them on your notebook because if we do the groups, they disappear, okay? Si de repente les hago grupos o algo, las, lo que les he mandado al chat desaparece. So if you have new vocabulary, Write it down. What about this one? What sentence could you give me with this one? Okay, let me just make it darker. Uh -huh. I used to do uh -huh. uh, snowboarding. Okay. But actually, I don't. I used to practice. You say, I used to practice snowboarding. snowboarding. But I don't do it anymore. Right, but I don't do it anymore. Es que ya no lo hago, right? I don't do it anymore. Okay, what about this one? Good evening, stomach cake. Stomach cake. Uh-huh. I had a stomach cake. I had a stomach cake. When? Yesterday. Yesterday, right? I had. A stomach cake mm -hmm. yesterday, uh, right? But now I have a, a headache. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I had a stomach cake for Christmas after eating mm. all that food, you say. Good. Very good. What about the next one? I will. I, I was, was to connect was... the television. Uh -huh. How do you say reparar? Fix. Repair. Repair. Fix. Fix. Right? Repair. Fix. So fix. you say okay. she fixed. She was fixed. Okay. But... Okay. She was fixed. No, yes. Ella fue reparada. <laughs> she fixed. <laughs> she fixed the fixed television. The television, the... right? The Very television. good. She fixed the television. What about this one? <laughs> Sorry, Kiara. Feeding the pets. Uh -huh. Feeding the pets. He. Okay. He Sorry. was feeding. He was feeding. Oh, he is pet. feeding the pets. He's feeding. He's feeding. <laughs> okay. I had I had my microphone off because my dog was barking to all the neighbor. He fed the, the cat. Singing. Yeah, <laughs> he fed the cat. Right in this case, Tiger. he fed the <laughs> the little cat, the little Michi. Right? Yeah, he fed the cat. Do you remember? Do you remember Los Pica Piedra? Yes. yes, right? There is a chapter yes. where they get one cat. Yes. Hay un capítulo donde adoptan un gato. <laughs> it's, a, mm -hmm. it's a big tiger. And no, no, it was a lion. So it's the same. He fed the cat. What about the next one? What sentence can you do with this one? She broke. She broke her leg, right? She broke her leg. She's taking care of the patient. She's taking care of the patient. Very good job. What about this one? Singer. She is singer. She? But wow. yesterday. She was sung, sung, sung. She was sung, no. She was Recordemos, si estamos ocupando los pasados y es un verbo, 
solamente, por ejemplo, en el caso de sing, sang, no decimos she was sang, porque no, ella fue cantada. No, it's not possible. She sang yesterday. She ella cantó. She sang, she sang yesterday, she sang right? Yesterday. She sang, sang, she yesterday. sang yesterday. What about this one? What is the past tense of ride? She rode. She rode. She rode. The bicycle. She rode the bicycle. Very good job. What is the past tense of shop? She bought. She shopped. Okay, shopped. Shopped is the same, shopped. right? She shopped. Yeah, she shopped. Or you can say she went shopping. She went shopping. She went to the supermarket. She went shopping to the supermarket. Or she bought many things she, she bought many things what is the past tense of do did did, did. did. he did, he did the washing he did the laundry the laundry he did the laundry right laundry. because if you laundry. say he washed the clothes by hand right he did the laundry laundry right? Now, when you say like, ay, que cansado, hoy la ve, they say, <laughs> they just tick, 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 tick. And they say. What about this one? What is the past tense of swim? Swam. 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 So, swam. he? He swam. swam. He swam. swam. In the pool. Swam. Swam. In the pool. In the pool. Okay. Now, what are the things that you used to do on vacation? I used to? Swam. swam. I used to swam. I used to swam. Uh -huh. Swim. Tin, tin, tin. Mm. When, cuando decimos, I used to, to ahí ocupamos el pasado. I used, I used to, to swim. To go to, to swim. swim. No, no, no. I used to swim. Used to Solía swim. nadar. And let me share my screen then, because I need to explain that in detail. So in this case, when you say the used to, and you use, you used to, right? I am going to write it here. I used to, okay, aquí ya tenemos el pasado. I uh -huh. used to swim, swim in the pool. The pool. Okay, I used to swim in the pool. And the most important thing, the period, right? The period, because the sentences are not complete without a period, right? Yeah, I used exactly. to swim in the pool. <laughs> Por experiencias. I used to swim in the pool. We say, I used to, uh, I used to play the piano. Right. In this case, como ya pusimos used to, y ahí tenemos la forma pasada, el verbo que vamos a ocupar as, after to, it's in normal form, ¿ok? Porque igual aquí ya tenemos el, eh, el verbo después de to, va siempre en su forma normal. I used to play, I used to swim, I used to swim, I used to read, I used to dance, for example. But when you use the negative, when you say I did not use to. Aquí no ponemos used with D because you have the auxiliary. I did not use to dance in the parties. Okay, el que iba solo a ver la fiesta y no bailaba. <laughs> I don't know if it was you. Right, yo desde que llegaba bailaba hasta que se iba la disco. But yeah, I love to dance. And I, I, I always do it, right? Si voy a una boda y hay baile, I, I dance <laughs> a lot. <laughs> so I love to dance. In, I love to dance. in yeah. weddings, uh, like, but any party, but not in like. Uh, I can say when when you go to the. I forgot the name, like um, a general party. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I like la, la verbenas, right? The the parties in the in the neighborhood. And they, I dance there. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I dance I, everywhere. I, I dislike it. Okay, the general parties, but in the yeah. private parties, mm -hmm. you dance. La, like fifteenth and and wedding, or, okay. or birthday. I I love to dancing. Okay, I love to dance. You say después de tu verbo normal. Okay, and the sweet fifteen parties. Sweet fifteen parties are quinceañeras. Mm -hmm. Those are the sweet 15 parties. Okay, so I used to what? I used to dance. No, what about this one? Uh -huh. I used to act. I used, I used to, to act. Used to Very act. good. I used to act. I used to. 
I used to cook. Drink. I used to cook. cook. I used to. Uh, uh -huh. I used to play the piano. I used to play the piano, right? But I used to. I used to play the guitar, right? But now I don't do it. I used to, let me see the next one. I used to. I used to. I used to the flowers. I used to, what can you do with the flowers? ¿Qué acción podemos hacer con las flores? I used I to. I used to sell the make. flowers. <laughs> I used to sell Sales. or to buy. I used to <laughs> buy flowers, right? Now for Valentine's, you have to buy flowers, people. Okay, so that is the form of used to. Right, when you say I used to, yo solía, solía hacer esto, solía hacer aquello, right? That is the form of used to. Okay, thank you. I, I, I had a picture, I don't know. There you go. I am going to share the book because we are going to check on the manual uh, this part of used to. Let me just stop this one and cha -cha -cha. here we go. Okay, I am going to share my book because I am going to go a little bit on the topic and then we are going to share together. So here you have the used to part of the book. And here we have so a little conversation, right? You have a little conversation here. And after the conversation, we are going to check the grammar. And it says, are these pictures of you when you were a kid? Yeah, that's me in front of my uncle's beach house. When I was a kid, we used to spend two weeks there every summer. We used to spend two weeks there every summer. Wow, I bet that was fun. Say, I bet. Te apuesto que era muy divertido. Yes. Yeah, it says, we always had a great time. Every day, we used to get up early and walk along the beach. I had a great shell collection. In fact, I think it's still up in the attic. Hey, I used to collect shells, too, when I was a kid. But my parents threw them out. What is the meaning of threw them out? It's like... What's this? I don't know. Yeah, to the garbage. <laughs> right? My parents threw them out. Me las botaron, right? Poor kid. So, uh, new words or new vocabulary that you can get from the conversation? True. Mm -hmm. like Fun. The last word, true. True. Uh, threw them away. Threw them out. It's like the past tense of throw. Throw es lanzar o aventar o tirar, right? Throw. Through is the past tense when you say, but my parents threw them out. It's like, if you see, for example, it's like, hey, what's this? The shit, nah. And you just throw it away. It's like, nah, I don't care. It's garbage, right? So when that's the meaning of that. The attic is the top part of the house, right? El attico. Here in El Salvador, we don't have that. But in the United States, it's very common to have this top part of in the roof of the house. That is the attic. And the shell are las conchitas. Okay. Por eso la gasolinera se llamaba shell. No sé si la recuerdan. Y tenía una concha. That was the name of the gas station. And shell is concha. And, yeah. But don't go and say, hi, aunt shell. No le va a ir a decir a su tía conchita. Y, Hola, tía shell. No. <laughs> Be careful with that. Okay. Yeah, it happens. It happens. So it says, practice with me. Hey. 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 Pero como para hey. llamar la atención de alguien. Hey. 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 Are these hey. pictures of you when you hey. were a kid? Are these pictures of you when you were a kid? Are these pictures of you when you were a kid? Are, Are these pictures of you when you were a kid? Yeah. 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 That's me in front of my uncle's beach house. That's me in front of my uncle's beach house. That's me in front of my uncle's beach house. That's me in front of my uncle's beach house. When I was a kid, when I, when was, I was, was, a kid, was a kid, we used to spend two weeks there every summer. We used to, we used to spend two weeks there every, 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 every summer. 
when I was a kid, we used to spend two weeks there when I was, uh, sorry, <laughs> I confused the conversation. When I was a kid, we used to spend two weeks there every summer. When I, when I was a kid, we used to spend two weeks there every summer. Every summer. Every summer. Wow, I bet that was fun. Wow, I bet that was fun. I bet that was fun. I bet, I bet that, that was fun. That was fun. 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 Yeah. 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 We always had a great time. We, we always had, had a great time. time. Every day we used to get up early and walk along the beach. Every day we used to get early and walk along the beach. I had a great shell collection. I had, I had a great shell collection. collection. In fact, I, I think it is still collection. up in the attic. I think it's still up in the attic. I think it's still up in the attic. 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 Hey, I used to collect shells too. Hey, I used to collect shells too. Hey, I used to collect shells too when I was a kid. But my parents threw them away. But my parents, my parents threw them out. But my parents threw them out. But my parents threw them out. Ajá, les cambié la wey y el auto a wey. You have to read as well, okay? You have to read as well. Let's see. Cesar Guadalupe and Cecilia Adrián. Go ahead. Hey, are these pictures of you when you were a kid? Yeah, that's me in front of my... Oh, sorry, uncles? You, my uncles? Uncle. Yes, it's because the, the screen is in the book. So I can read it. Okay, go, go, go. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh -huh. When I was a kid, I spent two weeks, three every summer. There, there. Continue. Wow. Wow, I bet that was fun. Yeah, we always had a great time. And I can read it. There. Every day. Every every day we used to get up early, walk along on the beach. I had a great shell collection. In fact, I think is in the attic. Hey, I used to collect shells too when I was a kid, but my parents threw them out. Threw them out. Very good job. Yeah. Claps for your friends, people. Applauso para nuestros participantes. Very good job, very good job, very good job. Yes, yes, yes. Excellent. Now I am going to ask Jesus Benitez and Sandra Leticia. Go ahead. Okay. Hey, are you this picture of you when you were a kid? Yeah. Was me in front of my uncle beach house. When I was a kid, we used to spend two weeks and there every summer. Wow. I bet that I bet that was fun. fun I bet fun. that was fun. I bet that was fun. I bet that was fun. Yeah. Wow. I, I bet that was fun. I bet that was fun. I bet that was fun. That I bet that was fun. I bet that was fun. That, that, that. I bet that that was fun. That was fun. Very good. Continue. Yeah, we always had a great time. Every day we used to get get up early and walk along to beach. The beach. I had a great um, along the beach. I had a great shell collection in fact i think it's still up in the attic hey you collect shells too when i was a kid but my parents 
threw them out. Threw them out. Very good job. Yay, that was good. The idea <laughs> is that you practice and that you lose the fear of speaking. And I am very glad with that. Very good job. And let me see, my last two volunteers. It's going to be... Chan, chan, chan. Yeah, Joanna <laughs> and Nidia. Go ahead. Hey, are these pictures of you when you were a kid? Yeah, that's me in front of my uncle's fish, fish house. And when I, when I was a kid, we used to spend to spend, spend. To spend two weeks there every summer. Wow, I bet that was fun. Yeah, we always had a great time. Every day we used to get up early and work along the beach. I had a great hair collection. In fact, I think it's still, it's still up in the attic. Hey. I used to collect shirts too when I was a kid, but my parents threw them out. My parents, my parents. parents. My parents. Okay, right. I bet that was fun. I bet that was fun. That, I that bet. <laughs> okay, the problem is that uh, as the two T's are together, right? Say, I bet that was fun. 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 There you go. Very good. And parents? Parents? Attic? Attic? Shells? Attic? Shells? And uncles. uncles? Uncles. That's me in front of my uncle's beach house. That's me in front of my uncle's beach house. My uncle's beach house. My uncle's. That's me in front of my uncle's beach house. Okay, so we are going to read the conversation again, all of you. Okay, all of you. So open your microphone and go after me. Hey, are these pictures of you when you were a kid? Hey, yeah, that's me in front of my uncle's beach house. Yeah, when I was a kid, we used to spend two weeks there every summer. When I was a kid, we used to spend two weeks there every summer. Wow, I bet that was fun. Wow, I bet that was fun. Yeah, we always had a great time. Every day we used to get up early and walk along the beach. Every day we used to get up along the beach. I had a great shell collection. I had a great shell collection. In fact, I think it's still up in the attic. In fact, I think it's still up in the attic. Hey, I used to collect shells too when I was a kid. Hey, hey. I, used to, I used to collect shells when I was a kid. Was a kid. But, my but, my but, my but my parents threw them out. But my parents threw them out. out. But my parents threw them out. Very good job, my dear but class. My parents threw them out. Threw them out. So this is the, is the form of grammar that we have been using with used to. And okay. <laughs> okay. Claro. Lentes. Okay. okay. <laughs> it was fun. Is it like amor? Huh? <laughs> oh. Qué lindo. Qué lindo mi grupo. I love it. <laughs> okay. In elementary school, I used to. These are the starting points that you can use for your sentences. Okay. I used to be, but I am not anymore. When I was a kid, I used to play. After school, my best friend and I used to. And when you start your speaking with your friends in the groups, you are going to say, when I was younger and I had vacations, I used to do this and this. I used to, did, I used to do this. I used to do that. And you are going to share with your friends the things that you used to do. Okay. So I got the idea from here. What we are going to go and do right now 
it's we are going to go and share, okay? When I was younger, I used to play the violin. I used to have a nickname. I used to have a pet. I used to play. I used to play basketball, right? We are going to share memories, right? We are going to share a little bit of memories. This is what we are going to do in the groups right now. So uh, the idea was this one, right? I got it from there. So right now I am going to send you to work in the groups. They are going to be groups of two or three because we are going to be sharing for one minute. So try to do it for one minute, okay? Traten de hablar alrededor de un minuto. Si tienen un timer por ahí, pónganlo para ver que ustedes compartan su historia en al menos un minuto, okay? That's the idea, that you can practice together and we are going to make groups of three and two, okay? We are going to make groups of three and two members and some groups are going to be made of four, okay? So let's go to the groups and let's share your one minute talk with your friends. Accept my invitations, please. And let's do it. Okay. There you go. Thank you very much. Accept my invitations, people. And let's go and share. Remember that what we are going to share is the story that we used, the things that we used to do when we were on vacations. Okay. Miguel Angel, have you received my invitation? Samuel, thank you very much. Cesar Guadalupe, did you receive my invitation? Jose Fernando, Alejandra. Thank you. Present hey, teacher. <laughs> Miguelito. <laughs> Hola. Ay, Miguelito, lo he perdido. ¿Qué, ¿Qué le pasa? ¿Qué le pasa? ¿Qué le pasa? Con los datos. Ok, Miguel, ¿le llegó la invitación para unirse a los grupos? Hello, hello, thank you. Samuel. Samuelito, Alejandra. Ay, DJ. ¿No le ha llegado la invitación para unirse al grupo? Mm, Miss, no. Yes. Eh, a mí no, se me no. llegó la invitación, pero estoy desde la computadora y aquí nada más estoy por el audio. Ah, ok, ok. Don't worry, don't worry. So go ahead, go ahead. Oh, yeah, I saw you in the other group. Don't worry. ¿Y Samuelito? Okay, lo voy a mover. Ahí está. <ríe> ok. Samuel me lo traje de vuelta. Hola. Ay. ¿Qué pasó, Samuel? Lo sacó de la sala. Sí, me sacó. Ok, no, lo, voy a, me... lo voy a mandar de regreso. There you go. Okay, let's go and see how they are doing. Skateboards. My grandfather used to buy bicycles and skateboards for us. Also, we helped with the housework. Uh, sometimes we went, we went to the beach or family. Uh, we rarely see our grandmother, my father's mother. Uh, we grew up only there. Only that class. Okay, this sounds great. When I was starting to talk, it was I was talking about my 
vacation, what I was used to do. Uh -huh. All right. Who's next? Who's next? Jose Who? Daniel or, or Elvira? Go ahead. Uh, my name is Jose Daniel. When, when I was young, I long stay Agos. Thanks <laughs> in my long did. time ago. <laughs> a few years ago. A few years ago. Oh, uh, I long time ago. Thanks. I didn't have a car. We went with my girlfriend, now my wife. The Tilbert Park. Okay. Tilbert <laughs> Park in Tilbert's vacation day Sunday. The famous. So happy bus always late from the east to uh -huh. for different tourist places, beach, tourist center, volcano. I watch her adventure. <laughs> yeah, I can see that you were adventurous. And you meet a lot of people. So you the met a lot of, and did you used to go by bus? Oh, super bus. Yeah. By bus, okay, with your we, girlfriend. Because we're uh, not high, eran bajo los costos. Yeah, I mean, yeah, the price was 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 very low, but I mean, it was nice that you were. It was your girlfriend, and now she's your wife. Oh my wife, my wife. Oh, uh -huh. aha. And the question is, are you still adventurous? Todavía son aventureros. That no. you go out and no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. My son. My son. Ah, maybe, because... maybe they'll they still to remember what happened <laughs> <laughs> at that time. Well, yeah. yeah. And now they have a kid. Mm, okay, good. Very, very modern. Okay, very but that modern. is that is that's good night. It, it's it, it's nice to have these beautiful memories of the things that you yes. used to do together. What a beautiful story, <laughs> Mr. Daniel. Okay, Elvira, share it, please. And I'm going to check on the next group. Okay, voy a ver si están trabajando los otros. Ya vengo. I will okay. come back in a moment. Is, is it uh, grandfather? Yes. Uh, <laughs> but uh, is he is the, the dead. Oh, he's dead, you say. He's dead. <laughs> uh, how do you say? I say, um, seven years ago. Seven years ago. Seven years ago. Yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, he, he, uh, I used to, uh, used to, grandfather, remember, uh, uh, contaba, como se dice, teacher? He Perdón. used, to, he used to tell us. He used to tell us. He used history. to tell us. History. History. Uh -huh. El Salvador. <laughs> the yeah. War, the wars. <laughs> the eruption. The, the best history. Eruption, the volcano. The volcano. Yeah. It, uh, very, very good. Hey, that's so nice, right? I mean, all these stories that you remember with a lot of love, I mean, that they used to say about the things from the country, el cipiti, yeah, or la ciguanaba, yeah. and all these things. Yes. I mean, <laughs> you, exactly. And then you get to remember them with a lot of love, right? You say like, ah, oh, my grandfather used to tell me that, right? That's why I always tell my father, tell stories to my kid about the things in, in the country, because maybe one day in the future, He's going to say, ah, my grandfather used to tell me this story. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. what what a nice, what a nice moment to enter to this room. Okay. So finish yeah. sharing and I'm going to check on the last group. Okay. I will go and check okay. on them. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Um, Hi. In the in the in the when I was younger. When I was younger, when I was younger, when I was younger, I used to, to play. I used to uh, play basketball mm -hmm. in the college. Pero cómo se dice me fracturé el tobillo. I broke. I broke my ankle. I broke my ankle. My ankle and and. Después de eso ya no jugué. And after that, I couldn't and play that, anymore. I couldn't play anymore. Oh, that's so yes. terrible. 
yeah I, I, love, love. I imagine right i imagine that that you used to love that okay what is the next story the next story or you share it already ya terminaron de compartirlas yes okay good so let's go back to the main session then let's go back to the main room hello again welcome back hello welcome back and okay thank you very much i was sharing i was sharing and listening to many of you talking about your stories and i am going to send you something here okay so thank you very much there are many stories about uh, the things that you used to do you used to visit family members you used to play a lot of sports you used to do many things when you were younger right nowadays we can even make a list of things that you used to do before covid and after covid right pudiéramos hacer uno de before covid i used to and now after covid i don't do it anymore <laughs> Uh, or during the pandemic i used to right what tell me one thing that you used to do on the quarantine challenge of instagram, of instagram. <laughs> okay I sleep a lot I sleep, I sleep a lot to do the challenges on, on instagram I sleep a lot you say did you cook bread ¿Quién hizo pan? Me, I cook bread. And that was delicious. Yeah, I cook bread. Let me see. Who was doing exercise at home? I did exercise too. Okay. But who never was? More. Yeah, never more. Okay. Who was, who was, for example, who used to shower in the garage before entering? <laughs> Who used to shower in the garage? No one, just me. <laughs> oh, yeah, I used to shower in the garage. <laughs> this is like when, when we used to go to the supermarket or something, as soon as we enter, we used to wash the car, like, shh, and the person as well. It was sad, but yeah, necessary. Did you ruin products from the supermarket? ¿Quién arruinó productos del super por lavarlos? Yeah, Only me. me I used to do that, yeah, and I still do it. <laughs> not, not me. Not you, right? Not you. Let's see. Who used to ah? Who used to do TikToks? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Alejandra. <laughs> all the dances of of the quarantine. Yeah, you can you can get another list of things that you used to do during the quarantine right i used to the prepare mangonias <laughs> oh yeah we used to do a lot of desserts right all the different desserts that that we had and that we appeared i mean it was the top thing right yeah preparar uh, pasteles o postres o cosas that was the top thing and yeah, we know I, uh -huh. i used to watch many films or or movies in netflix oh yeah i mean that yeah. became our best friend right yeah. I, I used to teach uh, classes online, I mean, during the yes. pandemic, right? But I mean, I, it was my first time and I was like, oh, okay, I was learning to do all these things. Okay. Uh, teacher. Yes? Eh, eh, Reina, ahí mandó en el, en el WhatsApp que ya no puede ingresar a la... Oh, Reinita, la what happened? Okay, se me fue por otro lado, ya la vi. Okay, let me find Reina. ¿Dónde andas? <laughs> Let me see. No, but I don't Very have long. anybody connected. No sé qué se me hizo. Hey, se me perdió Reinita. <laughs> no, she's here. She's back. Yeah. Ya vino. Ya vino. <laughs> she's back. Okay, let me share my book with you. We are going to go here. Okay. In the book, in your manual, right, we have here this part of the used to. In this section of the writing, is the one that I got for this idea, right? This is the one that I got for this idea that, hey, when I was younger, I used to do this. 
here, for example, in these questions that we have here, what is your favorite childhood memory? What is your favorite childhood memory? ¿Cuál es tu mejor recuerdo de la infancia? No debts, right? Que no habían deuda. <laughs> that was the best. Yeah. <laughs> that was the best thing. What sports or games did you used to play when you were younger? Mm -hmm. I listen basketball and soccer. What else? Volleyball. 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 Hide, es, es hide and seek. Hide and seek. Hide and seek. Hide and seek. Hide. I used to play ping pong. Ping pong, all right? Or table tennis. The name of this one is table tennis. And the other one is? Arranca cebolla. Marble. <laughs> hide and seek. I think arranca cebolla, it's like, uh, I think there is no an English there is no English translation for that, but chancha barancha. <laughs> chancha barancha. So like it can be pulling, right? Pulling because we used to pull people. Right? That was a very silly game. <laughs> si nos ponemos a pensar, o sea, el juego era como bien inocente, ¿verdad? Just <laughs> pulling people. <laughs> no. Okay, arranca cebolla, right? The pulling. We used to play pulling, and um, let's see. Uh, we used to play tag. Do you remember tag? Tag in this case is la lleva. Tag when you used to to touch a person and you used to run yes. and they Mika, had to yes. run. Mika, yeah. right? The same. <laughs> yeah. It's Did tag. And ladron y policía. Oh, that was like uh, thieves. Uh, I think that it's like the police and the thief. The police. And the, the thief. and the thief, okay, thief. the police and the thief, okay, and the thief, the police and the thief, that was like the, 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 those were our games, right, the little games that we used to have, where did you used to spend your vacations, donde pasaban sus vacaciones, at home or in a at family member's house? At the beach. Wow. At the beach. In your parents' house, right? In your family members' house. At the beach? That's another level of vacation. <laughs> That's beautiful. Did you ever have a part-time job? ¿Tuvieron algún trabajo de medio tiempo? After no. school. <laughs> After maybe, school. Maybe work with my mom or my dad. Oh, that's so nice. When you used to work with your dad or with your mom, that's good. I used to give English classes <laughs> in high school. Yep, I used to teach my friends English classes in my living room. En la sala de mi casa ponían los carteles. And I used to teach there. And I didn't want to be a teacher. That's a curious thing. Cuando tenía como 16, 17, decía yo, yo nunca voy a ser maestra. Ay, no, <laughs> And I used to teach them classes. And here I am, 19 years later, being a teacher, right? So Never say never. And yeah, never say, no, never say, I will never drink that water. <laughs> because here you are, thirsty. And here you have a reading about a young Shen, that it's the one that it's on your manual, right? You can get to uh, check it out. And if you get to see new words or new vocabulary, remember that we need to investigate it. But we are going to read it right now, right? We are going to read it and I am going to go over it. And if you find a new word or new vocabulary, let me know. Yan Shen is famous both in China where she grew up and in the United States where she now lives. How did Yan become a famous actress in two countries? It's an interesting story. Young Shen was born in Shanghai in 1961 when she was 14. Some people from a film studio came to her school and chose her to study at the studio. She was happy about this chance, but mainly she liked the idea of getting out of school. Soon, however, she discovered that she really liked acting. At age 18, she won the Golden Rooster, China's top film award. And it says here, in the late 90s, in the late 1970s, John's parents, who were doctors, moved to the United States. John joined them when she was 20 and went to college there. 
Her parents hoped she would study medicine. Instead, she majored in film and later looked for a job, uh, look for uh, work as an actress. Here you have it. Look for work as an actress to work in the United States. John had to start all over again. She told Hollywood agents that she was an actress in China, but she only got some small parts in shows. One day, John went to speak to a director who was making a movie called Tai Pan. The interview didn't go well. As she walked away, a man in the car noticed her. The man was Dino De Laurentiis, the film producer. He immediately offered her a leading part. A year later, she started in Bernardo Bertolucci's The Last Emperor and was on her way to worldwide fame. So you see, fame can appear anywhere, okay? What is the learning of this? Always keep an eye on how you look, okay? Siempre hay que peinarnos antes de salir. We never know who is going to see and say like, oh, an actress, I want her. Okay, new words or curious vocabulary that you don't know? Vocabulary that you say, I don't know the meaning of that word. ¿Qué significa mainly? Mainly, principalmente. Uh -huh. Okay. Another one? What is the uh, meaning of offered? Offered. When you say like, Nati, do you want to work? Yes, for sure. That's an offer. She offered a job. Offer. Ofrecer. Ofrecer. Uh -huh. Yes. Another one? World, worldwide fame. Worldwide fame. It's all around the world. Worldwide fame. From Australia to El Salvador. Worldwide. Alrededor yeah. de todo el mundo. Mundialmente. Famoso. A todo ancho. <laughs> a todo, yeah, from El Salvador to Australia. Yeah. Another one? Getting out, teacher. Getting out. Yeah. Salirse. She liked the, the idea of getting out of school, right? It was like, yay, I won't study anymore. Getting out is salirse. Another one? Major. Major. Okay, when you major on something, is that you study that at the university. Major is like, for example, when I ask you, what's your major at the university? And you say, ah, tourism, English, art, mathematics, right? She majored in film. Okay, ella fue a estudiar eh, eh, arte, películas. She, to become an actress at the university. Okay, ella se especializó en eso. She majored on that. What about the next one? Any other question? The leading part. The leading part is the main character. The leading part, right? Like in Batman. Batman has the leading part, right? Because he's the, the main character. The leading part is el actor principal. That's the leading part. I had it on the chat. Oh, don't worry ever, but it's good. I got it. Thank you very much. Any other question? Pronunciation questions? How do you get pronunciation questions? Y ahí me van a decir, teacher, pero como tengo una duda en pronunciación? I need you to go reading the paragraphs. In say like Yongchen is famous both in China. I mean, I need you to read the paragraphs, okay? Vamos a hacerlo solo con esta primera parte de aquí. Okay, we're going to do it with the first part. Okay, this part. Okay, these first paragraphs. These two paragraphs. Is I am miope. Come on, but you have it on the manual, okay? También lo tienen en su manual, ahí lo tienen también. Y en like, glasses. Okay, only, no. only this I'm part, okay? okay? So. Only that, okay? Uh, okay, how do you know if you have pronunciation questions? Read, okay, read. And you say, John Shen is famous both in China, where she grew up, and in the United States, where she now lives, okay? 
read it, vamos, entre todos, leámoslo. Y si se traban en alguna palabra, escríbanla y de ahí me hacen las preguntas. Go ahead. Studio. She was happy about the chance, but mainly she liked the idea of getting out of sight. However, she discovered that she really liked However, she really liked acting. Aha. Good. One problem, people. Don't invent words. Okay, no me inventen palabras. When you say John Shane is a famous, it's a famous both in Ch in China. Someone said in China, but is famous. I know you say a famous. John Shane is famous both in China where she grew up, grew up, and in the United States where she now lives. Okay, leamos solo esa oración. Young Shen is famous both in China where she grew up and in the United States where she now lives. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Take it easy. Take it easy. Important. Respect the punctuation. Okay. Tenemos que respetar la puntuación. ¿Por qué? Porque ahí decimos: John Shen is famous both in China where she grew up and in the United States where she now lives. Okay, intonation and pronunciation. Young Shen is famous both in China where she grew up and in the United States where she now lives. Go ahead. John Shen, John Shen is famous both in China where she grew up in the United States where she now lives. You see? Did you listen to the difference? Escuchan cómo cambia su pronunciación, cómo se entiende y a lo que van leyendo. Okay. How did John become a famous actress in two countries? It's a question. How did John become a famous actress in two countries? How, How did John become a famous actress in two countries? How did John become a famous actress in two countries? How did John become a famous actress in two countries? It's an interesting story. It's it's story. 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 Okay, now the paragraph. John Shen is famous both in China where she grew up and in the United States where she now lives. How did John become a famous actress in two countries? It's an interesting story. John Shen is famous, famous both in China where she grew up in the United States, States, States where she now lives. lives. How did you, How do you John, become, become a famous actress in two countries? It's an interesting story. story. It's an interesting story. It's an interesting, interesting story. story. Interesting, no. Interesting. Interesting story. Interesting. Interesting, interesting story. story. Okay, John Shen was born in Shanghai in 1961. John Shen was born in Shanghai in 1961. When she was 14, when she was 14, some people from a film studio came to her school and chose her to study at the studio. Some people from a film studio came to her school and chose to study at the studio. She was happy about this chance. She was happy about this chance. But mainly she liked the idea of getting out of school. But mainly she liked the idea of getting out of school. Soon, however, so, so, however, however, she discovered that she really liked acting. She discovered, she discovered that she really liked acting. Okay, 
lo último que vamos a hacer, the complete paragraph. Yong Shen was born in Shanghai in 1961. When she was 14, some people from a film studio came to her school and chose her to study at the studio. She was happy about this chance, but mainly she liked the idea of getting out of school. Soon, however, she discovered that she really liked acting. John Shane was born in Shanghai in 1914. Some people are not famous. Some people are not famous. Some people are not famous. How are the chances? What kind of thing like this? They are all sitting out of the school. However, this is a very accurate line. However, it is a very accurate line. She was a 14-year-old from a brand new film studio. Okay, that she really like acting. It is different. You see, when you give the proper intonation to the paragraphs, it is different. So we are going to stop here. I am going to call the attendance and we are going to go. Tomorrow we are going to finish working on this and we are going to work on compound nouns. Okay, I am going to send you the topic on the chat for you to investigate a little bit. It was so nice to have you practicing reading get readings people and practice they are going to be very helpful for you alejandra beatriz alejandra, thank you angelica yamilet cecilia de los angeles here teacher cesar guadalupe mr cesar here teacher thank you very much let's continue here okay cesar Here we go. Edgar Abel. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Edson Stanley. Present, teacher. Eduardo Jose. Present, teacher. Elvira. Present, teacher. Ever Ernesto. Ever Santa Maria. Thank you. Eh, Elvira. Yeah, right, all right. Ever Isabel. Present, teacher. Elvira. Thank Elvira, thank you. Isabel Elizabeth. Isabel escribió en el chat de... De WhatsApp, right? It's true. Yeah. Jenny Elizabeth. Hey, Jeremy. teacher. Thank you. Jeremías Ezequiel. Present, teacher. Joana Yesenia. Present, teacher. José Daniel. Present, teacher. José Fernando. Present. Karen Stephanie. Present, teacher. Catherine Alejandra. Thank you. Catherine Alejandra, José Miguel. O sea, Miguel Ángel, sorry. José Miguel. Ah, ya ando inventando José, José Miguel. Miguel. ¿Por qué me dicen José Miguel? Siempre, siempre me confundo con José Miguel. Alguien de mi vida pasó. Gracias, <risa> teacher. Thank you very Present. much. Ok, Nidia Esmeralda. Gracias, teacher. Thank you very much. Ok, Catherine Alejandra no estaba, vea. Nidia, sí. Raúl de Jesús. Present teacher. Reina Elizabeth. Present teacher. Samuel Isaac. Present. Samuel que yo en el chat. Creo. Thank you. No, but he's here. Sandra Leticia. Present teacher. Jancy Astrid. Present teacher. Thank you. Karen Stephanie. There you go. Thank you, Karen. I got you there. Okay. So I am going to see you tomorrow, my dear students. Thank you very, very much for your time today. And I hope you have a fantastic night. I am going to see you tomorrow for your next class. Have a good yeah, night. Teacher, see you tomorrow. Have a beautiful night. Bye. Bye. See you. Bye-bye.